Toast is good in the morning. It's one of the best methods to fuel yourself with enough carbohydrates for the day. I like it a little bit burnt, so that it's really crunchy. On the weekends I sometimes make bacon, but only sometimes. It makes such a mess. If things aren't clean around you, then you can't focus. And when you're not totally focused, you're not working hard enough. I can't leave the house if I haven't had a cup of coffee either, with milk and sugar. Otherwise it's far too coarse for something to be consumed in the morning. If you start the day with a bad taste in your mouth, you're most certainly going to finish with one. Ten hours ago, when I had my first drink of the night, I thought this is it. The time is now and the place is here. What more could I want? My friends would be there, the vodka would be cold, and there would be enough people to buy me all of it. There would even be enough snow to cover the M6. There always is. This was going to be one of the bigger nights this week. And the bigger nights are the better nights. Get the yeah. To who? But no. Yeah. Yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. The least you can do is offer me a drink. So what's a nice city boy like you doing in a place like this with a drink like that in his hand? I'm not a city boy. What are you then? Thirsty. You shouldn't be having a productive day. Oh, and you are. <laughs> Look like you have quite an important job. Aren't they going to care that you're not sat in front of your computer? I thought it was an important job. But I'm not important enough for it, apparently. Says who? Says men in better suits than me. So what's the deal? Are you fired or something? May as well have. Well, if you still have a job, what are you doing sitting here crying like a baby? This may be hard for you to understand, but people like me spend their whole lives working. We've been taught that you reap what you sow, and well, for the first time that hasn't happened. Instead of being rewarded for good work, I'm being sidelined, being thrown to the margins. 
Sitting here hardly constitutes working yourself to the bone. And if you really cared about whatever it was that happened this morning, you would go to where you need to go and you would fight your case. Yesterday, that's what I would have done. Today. Well, if they treat me like this, maybe they don't deserve me. Oh, fighting talk. It always seemed logical to me. My mum and dad both worked hard all day, every day. They never let their lives become complicated by relevant outside factors. They were focused. I've tried to live like that. Always put work first. Because if you work hard, you will be rewarded. What are outside factors? Anything that might detract from work. <laughs> Generally this. Anything alcohol related? I don't even remember the last time I had a drink. I always tried to stay away from anything that I thought might affect my frame of mind. I thought it might affect me in the long run. I couldn't be doing with the complications either. Jesus, you're fucking killing me here. What are complications? Don't be so naive. Someone like you ought to know. What's that supposed to mean? Why do you care anyway? Humour me. Okay. Well... Because I never thought it was a good idea to drink, I never used to attend events such as, you know, parties or reunions, you know? I, uh, I don't have a huge amount of social skills. I never, never needed them. I just thought better to focus on work, not get distracted, not have to deal with any problems. Or... So what you're saying is that you don't like to have fun in case it interferes with work a little. That's not what I'm saying. No, that's exactly what you're saying. You don't want these complications to interfere with your life so you can what, work harder. I don't know if anyone's ever told you this before, but life is meant to be about having a good time. And you look pretty sad this morning. I mean, I don't know, but it doesn't look like you've enjoyed yourself for quite a while. Just because something doesn't have a big paycheck at the end of it doesn't mean it's not as important as work. And you're simply going to just deny yourself a full life if you want to work all the time. I never said I want you to work all the time. I just... I feel it's more important. What well, bullshit it is. So you're going to work all the time, which isn't what you want to do, so then clearly you're not happy. So you're going to, what, work until you're 45, die a stress-related death? And what's the point? It's common sense. <laughs> I'm getting cold. Do you want to walk a little? Sure. 